how about a guy we all know quite well, Nate Prosser, as we flash back to Hockey Day 2014 in his home city of Elk River, of all things, gets the overtime winner. Another huge win for Minnesota to cap off a day of celebrating the game we all love. Well, earlier today, our very own Alex Zappa caught up with Mr. Prosser. Hockey Day Minnesota continues from the cities, and we find ourselves in Plymouth in Nate Prosser's house here. Uh, Nate, first of all, thank you for letting us inside. Second of all, here's the Hockey Day Minnesota, someone who grew up in Elk River. You're very familiar with this holiday. Your career with the Wild, you were part of it every single step of the way. What did this day start to mean to you through your years at the Wild, learning what this day, this culture is all about? Yeah, I mean, I started learning about it um, around that, that time. Just uh, so much excitement around the cities. I mean, and uh, beyond, I'm sure. Um, you know, you go into hockey rinks or basketball courts. It, I was in them today, and er, uh, all anyone ever wanted to talk about was Hockey Day in Minnesota. Every day on Hockey Day, I was went into the rink a little bit earlier, had, probably had an extra Red Bull that, that night, and <laughs> just was a little bit more amped up, more jump in the legs. Um, just the, 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 the excitement around the arena at the, at, at that night and um, just kind of built up in all of us. And Hockey Day Minnesota has been a good day for you specifically. I want to take you back to one back in 2014, January 18th, I would have to think that that OT winner stands pretty tall amongst the goals that you got to have in the NHL. Yeah, um, that was at the top. Um, you know, I, it was a situation that I never get in. I, I don't, I don't remember another shift in overtime in the rest of my career. So that was kind of the one time Rick Wilson tapped on my shoulder, said, "Hey, Pross, you're up." And I, you know, I had to look back at him and be like, "Is he messing with me?" Type of deal. And um, you know, he's, he said, "No, get out there, get out there." So I got out there. Um, you know, kind of rim the puck in behind. I remember Coyle collecting it, getting it out to Niederreiter. Shoots the puck on net. Um, just that moment, I felt like I, it, was a, it was the right time. Puck popped up to, out to me and put it in. And um, yeah, it's something I'll always remember and tell my grandkids about someday for sure. When you think of this day in general, what are some of the memories and the moments that you're going to um, really cherish with you and bring with you the rest of your life? Yeah, that's a I mean, great question. It's, uh, you know, my wife put together a retirement video for me, and I just seen so many of the old teammates that I, I was able to um, see on the video and the messages I received, um, just so much support from those guys. I, I feel like those relationships you build, um, those teammates that you had, um, the trainers, the radio guys, I mean, it, the list goes on. It, there's so many good people along the way, and it, it's, it's those friendships that I'll truly remember. I'm, I'm, I was so blessed to play for the hometown team for so many years. And The fans at the Excel Energy Center, the best across the whole NHL. For you, how appreciative have you been towards these fans and maybe a so long message to them because I'm sure they've had your back this whole way, yeah. and I think that you have theirs as well. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I mean, they, they've always been so supportive of me. This state truly loves the wild, and it is the state of hockey, and, um, you know, the fans have always been number one to me, and um, I, I, any way I was able to give back through charity or different organizations, I, I always wanted to do that and give back to the state. Former Wild defenseman Nate Prosser, thank you so much for welcoming us into your home. Yeah. Thanks for coming. It's Hockey Day, Minnesota. It's a hockey holiday from Plymouth. These two guys signing off.